Hey guys, Jason here, and today I'll be showing you some apps, settings, and tips and tricks that will drastically improve your Android device's battery life. Before we jump into the video, we first need to understand what actually causes our battery to drain. There are a number of factors that will affect your battery life, but the main ones are your screen, wireless networks, and apps on your device. With that being said, let's jump right into some tips and tricks. So first, I want to share an application that will help tame power consumption caused by your device's screen. It's called Pixel Filter, and for devices using AMOLED displays, this will save you a ton of battery life. Essentially, the app allows you to turn off individual pixels on your device's screen, anywhere from 12 to 88% of them, and as a result, those pixels won't consume any energy, and as a whole, your screen will use less battery power. For devices that don't feature AMOLED displays, it's best to ignore any adaptive brightness or auto brightness features, and just keep the screen brightness as low as possible in order to save battery. After we minimize the amount of power our screen uses, we next need to take care of various wireless networks that suck away our battery's juice. There's Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, NFC, GPS, and mobile data. The best way to control the amount of power used by these wireless networks is just to turn off the ones you rarely or never use, and to use an app called Hibernation Manager to handle the rest of them. Hibernation Manager allows you to select certain wireless networks to disable while your screen is off. It's actually really smart, because the second you turn your screen back on, all those wireless networks are re-enabled, and you won't miss any important notifications. If your device happens to be rooted, you can take advantage of another feature the Hibernation Manager app offers. I'm talking about the CPU Hibernator, which will basically set your CPU to run at the lowest possible frequency while the screen is off, which can save quite a bit of battery. After we've taken care of the power consumption caused by our device's screen and wireless networks, the last thing remaining consuming unnecessary amounts of battery power are the apps on our device. In order to keep certain apps from sucking up our battery life, we'll be using an app called Greenify. Using Greenify is super simple. You just jump into the app analyzer and scroll through a list of your apps and select the apps that Greenify should be allowed to hibernate when not in use. I recommend letting Greenify hibernate your social media apps when not in use because those apps tend to drain your battery by running in the background. Last but not least, there are some settings we can toggle manually to help conserve battery life. First of all, try looking through your device's settings for various built-in power saving modes. Second, take a look through your device's battery and data usage menus in the settings app. From these menus, you might find some apps that are using a lot of battery or data, and you should probably consider hibernating those apps using Greenify. After I applied all the tips and tricks from this video, I was able to get a little over two full days out of my phone's battery, instead of the one day of battery I was getting previously. However, if you want to see a more in-depth battery life test, go ahead and drop a comment down below. Besides that, I really hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please subscribe to Arium TV. Go ahead and like and share this video as well if you're feeling like being awesome, and as always, I'll catch you guys in the next video.